Jane A. Gersenbrookie, and I'm going to read from my book, A Treatise on Stars. Their skies are full of life. She describes starlight as scalar without properties of distance or time. Any spirit in matter she calls star walking, remote viewing, meditation, intuition, plants she was shown. And any soul possessing a certain shine she calls starlight. The power of relation came through their extraordinary yellow eyes, she tells me. You're looking into a star, convex, immense, flashing colors through opalescent, flowing, nuclear fusion. I feel separated from home now. I look up at night sky with great longing. They showed me earth through their eyes. Their oneness extends to us, whereas I'm in the dark. Then it opens onto luminescence. There's a lot of snow. There's a lot of stars, huge, no horizon, and very bright. I see the Pleiades. I feel like a wolf looking toward home. Phew, a shooting star just dropped there onto snow. So I go over to it. A crystal has dropped on the snow and there's light, a face in the stone. It's as if I'm looking up through the sky and things are very clear and I'm coming up through the ice. I've been below all this time and now I see stars. Thank you.